Hello, 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 everyone. I am so excited to be here, as is Rachel, because in today's live stream, we are announcing our brand new SVG digital cut file collection at makersgonnalearn.com. Guys, as you guys tune in, share with us where you're visiting from, what you've got going on today. It is Wednesday, halfway through the week. Ugh, Rachel, how are you doing? I'm doing well. Um, we've been very busy today, but we're so happy to be able to take a break and talk to all of you guys and share some exciting news about our new collection with you yeah, all. Yeah, it's going to be so much fun. So guys, what we've been doing all day is filming awesome Christmas videos and new videos for you guys at home. We've been coming to you almost every single day with live streams, but that doesn't mean we need to stop all of our polished, awesome video tutorials. So all day today, our videographer is in and we are filming probably like six minute videos minimum, but probably maybe we can get up to eight there's quite a few videos i want to go through that are going to be really great but all morning we were making christmas projects for our christmas tree uh, I can't wait to share that with you. But guys, is anyone tuning in? Yes, we have Missy, Kimberly, Ivy, hey. uh, Rocky, Denise, Samantha, just to name a few. Uh, a bunch of people tuning well, in. hey guys, if you are brand new here, every single month we have a new collection of cut files that comes out at makersgonnalearn.com. And this month's collection is called our pet collection. This is a great collection for all kinds and different sorts of projects. So in these videos, we always have projects laid out for you that gives you inspiration as soon as the collection comes out. So if you are a member, go run, don't walk, run to download this collection today because you're not gonna wanna miss out on all of these cut files and you're gonna wanna get crafty. Guys, I don't know about you all, but it's the holiday season as we've been talking about for the past few weeks. Um, but you need to be able to give gifts that are about all the people in your life that have dogs. Like look at this shirt right here, coffee, Netflix, and dog cuddles. Like how many people would die for this as a gift? I don't know about you all. I always go on and look at TJ Maxx and different stores to get people that I know that have pets different types of gifts, but this collection is going to help take the burden away for a lot of different things like that. So first things first, if you are not a member of Makers Gonna Learn, let us know if you're not a member and if you have any questions about it. But if you want to get a membership, click the first link below. But I bet there's a lot of you out there that already have a membership. And if you do, like I said, you want to get this downloaded because we have different cards we have svg cut files we have print and cut files there's a lot of different things you're not going to miss out on that you can use but if you do not have a membership click that first link below okay and that will send you to our sign up page so what you do is you get registered right here um, this blue button is our best value and that's our year option and you're going to get a collection like this every single month and we already have a huge library of cut files Rachel like over what 500 different cut yes, files and how many just for Christmas oh uh, Christmas we have over 150 Christmas files and you get tons of collections so we're about to dive in to this collection and run through the projects and then showcase some of the files but if you haven't got to join yet go ahead and get started today make your Christmas gift ideas make your Christmas decor your ornaments oh my gosh we have more member projects and some member pets to share with you from the Facebook group so if you have a die kitting machine our SVG files work with your Cricut maker your Cricut Explorer your brother scan and cut your silhouette it's seriously awesome and I just want to say something We've had a few members or um, subscribers rather have commented, I'm a little scared to join the membership because I am not, I feel like I'm not tech savvy enough to use the cut files. We have multiple training videos for you and it is really easy. I promise if it's not easy, we will help guide you, give you the assistance to be able to use these cut files. I promise. Um, so it's definitely going to be a lot of fun. But here's the three different tiers. Um, we have a monthly option, a six month and a yearly for you. And the six month and yearly option do give you financial incentives um, to save a little money for selecting those. But in addition, we give you the bonuses of different e-courses and we have some awesome perks coming to the year membership. And it honestly, right away pre-orders you for another 12 months of cut file collections just like this one. 
So it's pretty cool. Uh, so check that out if you're not a member, the first link below. But Rachel, what's everyone saying? We do have a few questions. Ooh, already. okay. Uh, Rocky would like to know. Hey, Rocky. I joined on Friday as a year member, but have not been able to access any of the files. Can someone help me? Yes. So send us a email on our, oops, I'm hitting things, Rocky. Sorry. Um, send us an email on the contact form, which is found on the left-hand sidebar of Makers Gonna Learn, and we will get you access if you need an account. Um, if you already have an account and you're not sure how to download, we also posted an amazing video on Monday that teaches you how to take the collections from your dashboard and actually get them into Cricut Design Space. It's really good. So check that out if you haven't as well. And Cookie would like to Hey, know, Cookie. Do you know where to find transfer tape that's extra sticky and will work on glitter vinyl? Um, Cricut has some really great strong grip transfer tape. Thanks for asking. Great question for yeah. this holiday season. Everyone's getting crafty with glitter. But let's talk cut files. Let's talk about some of these projects. And then we'll actually share with you the entire collection, right? Kat actually has a quick question. Oh, hey, Kat. Uh, can you do more layering tutorials in the future? Yeah, well, totally. We have a few of those. So browse our back catalog and you will will find some. It is really good stuff. And we're actually filming one today about layering vinyl. So it's funny you're mentioning that. And so Tanner, <laughs> uh, Pat just wants to make sure. Hey, Pat. So there's new collections coming out every month. Yes, Pat. So that's what's cool about this being a membership is you're getting cut files to keep forever every single month like these here. We have a back catalog of over like 500 files you're able to use. It is a lot of fun and you're not going to want to miss out. So you can get started at Makers Gonna Learn at the first link below if you would like to join us. Seriously, anyone with a die cutting machine is going to love the membership. So if there's any active members here, say hey, let us know if you love your membership, let us know what you've got going on, um, especially what you plan to do with this collection. I have to say, this is a very anticipated collection. There's been a lot of people ask for it, so I'm glad that we're able to deliver it to you guys today. Um, and I'm super excited, because this again, is a really well-versed collection from print and cuts to pattern paper, oops, um, to more print and cut. And then we actually even use the collection as like templates to make some more DIY projects. Which is so creative. It's so easy to do yeah. string art. And I love the Cricut because traditionally you would have to use like a stencil or like try to hand cut a stencil. Using a Cricut for your template, no brainer. Like it's a seriously a no brainer. So are there any questions? Uh, no, but Pam, okay. you hey, Pam. asked about um, whatever I was doing and yeah. if your members were tuning in. Pam said, I just renewed my membership. Best membership Aww. ever. I'm 61 years old, and if I can do this, anyone can. Yes, Pam. And Rachel and his staff are the best. <gasps> Thank you so much, Pam. That seriously makes my day. So Madeline said, hi, Tanner and Rachel. I just joined a few minutes ago. <gasps> Let the fun begin. Yes, Madeline. We're so excited you joined. And guys, seriously, Pam said it the best. If she can do it, anyone can do it. Read some of the testimonials on the membership page. They're so sweet. We love showcasing our members and I'm just so excited that we get to pour into you guys every single month. And as I always say, joining our membership is the best way to support everything we do here from the free videos you watch on the YouTube channel to being able to make amazing cut files to these projects like pay Rachel, like all of these things, like that's the number one way to support what we do. So thank you guys. We, you all are incredible every single day. And Avi does have a good hey, question. Hey Avi. Are there any patterns for doggy clothing? Oh, I mean, there are plenty of patterns in the collection which we're about to dive into, so maybe you can see some that you'd want to use. But we also have just regular pattern paper in some of our collections that I think would be really adorable as doggy clothing. I think there's some in the summer collection and a few others that I would really think would look adorable on, on pets. <laughs> Um, but okay, let's talk about some of these projects. These are really easy. Now this right here is adorable. What we were able to do was, you've seen these everywhere guys. This is a, um, like a little frame from Michaels and we actually was able to scan this into Cricut and have them cut this exact size and shape for our frame, which I love. And we just painted it orange. And this is pattern paper, Rachel. So we printed this from our collection. We, a lot of members may not know this, but we have 
pattern paper in almost every collection. We have the cut files, we have print and cut files, but I love these. And then you can put a little picture of your, your cat, maybe a picture of you and your cat. I don't know, Rachel. How cute. That it's adorable. adorable. Yeah. And we love, we love the pattern papers. Yeah, I love fun. yeah. And we try to do that in every collection, which is really cool. Yeah. So we also incorporate what we love here. And this is the um, traditional hand lettering aspect of our membership, which people die and love over. Um, home is where the dog is. I love this. It's this is so adorable. Cute. I just absolutely love this and you can do this for yourself. This would be one of those gift ideas for your friend that's obsessed with a dog. Like, let's get real. We all have them. It's awesome. So this right here, I want to make for a few of my friends for sure. Oh yeah. Coffee, Netflix, and dog cuddles. So cute. Rachel. Such a nice personal project. It's yeah. adorable. So cute. It's perfect. And then we have this um, love pillow and it has the paw print. That's such a cute touch. I right? love this doll. I love it. And you guys, what you could do is you could dye this pillow if you wanted. Oh, yeah. You can use just the canvas. You can use pillows that are already like finished pillows. We have multiple videos teaching you how to use an easy press on pre-stuffed pillows that don't have a zipper to unstuff. Um, but we just love this file because it's adorable. But think about that on like the back of a car is a car sticker. I'm <gasps> down to your dog's collar. Too cute. I love, I love it. And then we also include some really fun ones. I actually want to um, print this larger and just have it as wall art in my home. So I love this. This is a, a perfect little a little card for you to make for someone send them a little note and and this is really easy like it's two steps you cut the card base in blue and then you cut you print and cut the love you long time your, your cricket does all the work it does all the work for you rachel you glue it together what like two strips of glue done yeah. hello done. awesome card really affordable better than paying like six or seven dollars for a card at walmart mm -hmm because I'm not giving Hallmark all that money right. when we have crickets. And I know a lot of you at home have crickets. So that brings up a great point. Makersgonnalearn.com. We get questions about what is our goal? What is our mission? What is our purpose? And it's really to help you guys stay creative in every aspect of your lives. So we want to help you stay creative every single month. We come to you with a new collection, with new ideas, new projects, and different things like that. So that is what we're, our mission is to do. And that's hopefully what we do every single day here. So um, that's something we are very passionate about. Um, but we also have kitty cat which i think is adorable i it love it so cute. i love a good play on words yeah like this is awesome and it, this is actually look this is a textured mug and look at the yeah. vinyl no bubbling yeah. it's went on really smooth perfect for any cat lovers and i love to say this but you know if you know the recipient's favorite candy fill it with candy cellophane bag perfect little gift i love that idea rachel this is the perfect idea and especially the holiday seasons that is what's go take you know a mug that you could get for a dollar or two from dollar tree and give it that extra value co-workers um anyone your kids teachers if you know they have a special pet that's a great idea Definitely. and jordan has a hey jordan question. Have you ever tried using Cricut as a stencil for fabric paint rather than just heat transfer material? Yes. So back before I even, here's a little, this is a little insight on me. Um, oh, back before I was even comfortable using HTV or iron on, that's what I would do. Um, I would use freezer paper to create stencils with a die cutting machine and then use fabric paint. But let me tell you, this is another secret. Once I realized that there was um, HTV iron on, game changer. You'll never get crisp lines like you get with your iron on. Um, every single time I use like freezer paper or even vinyl to make a stencil, it would always not be such clean edges. And you can't, yeah. you can't like be the, cl the crisp edges of iron on. So okay, that's a it's big, so much easier, less messy. For sure. For and sure. Kat wants to know, hey, how Kat? do you keep the vinyl on the cups for a long time? Um, so we also recommend hand washing. We never want to put in the dishwasher and we, you want to use premium vinyl or outdoor vinyl and Cricut has both. Both of those are really great, but yeah, hand washing is your best yeah, bet definitely. for that. So this project right here, we talked about it earlier, but we're just using a template. It is super easy. Super fun to trace that out. And this is a great example of using Cricut and just cutting with cardstock to be able to trace this out to um, hammer in all of your nails. 
um, as a great way that you're not actually putting vinyl, cardstock, or anything on a project. I love nail art, don't you? Tina? I love it. It's so cute. It's so easy. It's really nice. Yeah. Um, and then right here, last but not least, the look at this project, Rachel. These are little print and cut, adorable floral um, paw prints. That is the cutest. Which you can use and create your own pattern for anything to put. You wanna know what I'm gonna use this for, Rachel? I'm gonna keep my dog collars <gasps> and things in How here. Cute. Just because we need a place for it. So we, when the dogs go to the groomers, we can open this up, pull out a dog collar, call it a day. Nice and organized and it looks adorable. And yeah. We have like five dogs, so they have their own bedroom, so they can just hang out in their bedroom and well, call it a day. Nellie. Hey, Nellie. Nellie B, she was my friend with a pet bird. <gasps> hey. And she wants to know why there's no bird files, Hannah, because Nellie, I, I know. have a bird too, and I know we discussed it. I, I know, I know. So we're going to, this is not the end of our pet collection. No, we yet. we will be adding in more files and different things like that. So let me share with you all of the files in our pet collection yes. so that we can see what all is in there. This is just a few. We just make a few every month to get you guys. Right. Stuff. So these aren't all the files at all, um, but I'm not for sure if we have anything about birds. That's why we're about to look at it. So but that's okay. That's Maybe okay. Maybe next time. There's yes. always time yes. to, to get some new ones. So let me go back. This is your digital die cutting dashboard. So if you're looking to become a member, as soon as you get access to your membership, um, get your login, you know, get signed up, registered and whatnot, you're going to get access to our library of cut files. Now, Rachel likes to point out it's Christmas time. So over 150 just Christmas files across four different collections. Um, as you can see here, every single month a new collection is released i mean there's there's hundreds of files guys like you're going to be inspired you're going to love crafting and you're going to love crafting with us in your die cutting machine so as you can see here lots of different files like i can get even overwhelmed with some of these but right here on top our pet collection if you're on desktop all you do is click on it if you're on ios all you do is click on it so you just click on it right here and it's going to load and you're going to see it's a zip file. So we're going to click open in files and you can use our cut files in or on your iPad, iOS, anything like that. Um, so let's just open this up here. Miss C would like to know, she actually has two questions. Hey. One, can you use a heat gun with vinyl on a wine glass or coffee mug? I believe so. I have not done it personally, but if you're using iron-on, you would need to. But if you're using traditional vinyl, um, you're good. You don't need heat for it. But I have heard a few things about that. So and question two yes. is, did you guys send out an email to let us know that the new files were added? Yes, there was an email newsletter sent out earlier today. Um, I believe it was sent out or it's scheduled for today, but that email does go out on the launch, the collection launch day. It, um, our email provider sends it out in different batches so that you may get it. You may have got it earlier today. You may get it this afternoon, but I did send that out. So you'd be um, ready to find it in your inbox. And then by tomorrow, if you didn't get it, let me know so we can make sure you're on the list. Right. So, and, uh, how much are the, all these files? And we have a couple people oh, asking great how question. to join, how much it is to join. Yes. So click the first link below. These files are not sold individually. They are part of our membership site. So being a member gives you instant access to over 500 digital cut files. And there's three different membership tiers. So you can do monthly, yearly, and six month options. The yearly option will be your best bet because that pre-orders you into another year of cut files and it gives you access to our entire library which is awesome and you get access to hundred and fifty dollars worth of different e-courses teaching you how to use your Cricut Maker your Cricut Explorer and we're adding in special bonuses for our year members so definitely think about that and all of these files we give you a free commercial license so stay tuned with us um, you're going to love everything and you can check all of this out and get registered to get your cut files at the first link below so remember that it's always the first link to get registered for your own membership which you are going to love it our members love getting crafty with us and i know you will too so here let's go oh let's go through let's move this over here um so let's go through some of the files now i want to point this out you can manipulate our files so like look this is um how it was supposed to be when we designed it but look we just tweaked it a little 
and it's adorable. So we just kind of twist it around. Yeah. Uh, and I'll preach that all the time. I love that you can make them your own, cut different things out of it. Like when we use the ornament, we use yes. the truck and it said, you know, I Christmas love the truck. trees or whatever it said. Mm -hmm. I love that file. But yeah. You just take it out and make it yours, you know, make yeah. sure that... It's exactly how you want it, which I love. So this is another thing. This is um, a really adorable pattern paper. Um, and you can use this in multiple different ways. You can use it a pattern, anything like that. We love it. Home is where the dog is on our one of our files and projects, which we love. Um, this right here, coffee, Netflix, and dog cuddles. This is adorable. Oh, this right here is our card. So you can see here, long... Love you long, long time. Long you I'm trying to read it upside down. Love you long time. Yeah. <laughs> I've been going, guys, since like 7 a.m. this morning, like filming. So a little tired. Um, one thing I do want to point out, people ask about what size our collections are. So just because you're seeing only eight projects today, you're in every collection getting at least 30 different cut files. Um, coffee, Netflix, and dog cuddles. <gasps> Look at this one. Oh, I love it. The treats this. make my tail like that's super cute. Right? Ugh, it's adorable. Oh my goodness. Rachel, you're going to have to read some of these. I can't read upside down. You can't buy love, but you can rescue it. I love uh, that. How many of us have rescued a pet or something? Give us thumbs up. Give us yes. comments. Let us know. I think this is adorable. You need this file. And look, this love right here is the same love on the pillow. See? Just make it your own. I love that. Right. You can really embrace that. And then you get the paw print in the heart, Tricky. which is adorable. And this is actually part of our wall art. So like this is a pattern you can print out and be really awesome decor so then right here i heart my dog i love this file and um, yes how did just said can the files be modified yes like yes. we were saying you can modify them however you want she yeah. said for example can i take out the word coffee on the coffee netflix and of cuddles? course absolutely that would be super easy to oh do. my gosh netflix and dog cuddles look at this guys see yeah. this is who was that that commented that um Heidi. Heidi, look, yeah. this would be adorable. So, so, so all you do, Heidi, contour this out. This is one button. And the reason you can tell that is because it all is linked together. So like yeah. one button, contour that out. Yep. Netflix and dog cuddles, you have an amazing cut file. Yeah. And I'm not a big coffee fan either. So I can see why you would want to do that. Now, Rachel, this right here, if you look at some of our finished photos, we don't have the finished project today. This is a dog mat. So we yeah. had a few people comment, hey, can we use these cut files as um, stencils? Yes. We use this as a stencil with cardstock or a little thicker poster board. And we just spray painted this onto a doormat. Check out that project. This is huge. You're it's gonna want so this. It's so cute. It's yeah. adorable. Great DIY gift idea. Uh, I heart my cat. I love this pattern paper. Love that. So adorable. Aww. You, me, and the dog. That's so <laughs> cute. Oh, I hurt my cat. This is another pattern. We got the brick. Um, this is a card, guys. So if you want a little um, paw print card to be able to make something really easy, really quick, really simple, this is your card base for you. Phone. We love it. Um, really simple. And then we have the oh, cat. Oh, that's beautiful. I love the pattern. Just some art, just some mm -hmm. wall art for a cat lover. Great Christmas idea. Yes, and then the card. And then look at this, Rachel. I love that. The three little key cats. So <laughs> cute. I love it. We have the There's love the separate. Love. Yes. yes. Best dog mom ever. Who is a best dog mom out there? Leave us comments. Let us know about your babies because let's face it, we know your pets are your babies. Um, Rachel, this file. Yes, attitude. <laughs> Imagine this on a t-shirt, Rachel. Hello. Oh love that. Look Hello. at the little ears. Oh, it could be the little pocket t-shirts. Yeah. We love doing little Super pocket t-shirts. Yeah, good idea. Yeah. Less Aww. people, more cats. I love it. <laughs> oh, it's great. Live, love, bark. Oh, love that. Right? So we really have a diverse collection of yeah. cut files. We have the print and cut files. I mean, there's so many. Meow or never. So uh, look at that. This is the file we use for the frame. Oh, love this. So as you can see here, so many awesome files, so many possibilities. This one is one of my favorites. Like, look at that. Really cute. Yeah. For, for mama. For mama. This would be great. Um, talk about a decal on a car. Oh, definitely. Hello. So cute. Love that. Aww. Live like someone left the gate open. <laughs> Another great decal, especially yeah. if you have like a, um, a German Shepherd or a, a Golden Retriever. Yeah. 
Love that. So cat. yes. Uh. And Jordan has a pretty good. Hey Jordan. Pretty good question. Do you exclusively, exclusively, excuse me, use Cricut materials to cut? What are the benefits versus, or versus using other brands? So I love Cricut. My theory, and I preach this all the time, um, is if Cricut's good enough to make my die cutting machine, their materials are obviously going to work extraordinary. And guess what? They work awesome. So until I'm unhappy with how great they are, um, I am going to continue using theirs. I love it. And honestly, you can find it on really great sales. So stock up. Black Friday is coming up next week. So stock up on vinyl. They're going to have great sales. I mean, half of the time they have like 50% off like vinyl cardstock iron on like all that stuff so get the best quality material for your projects like Rachel talks about it if you're going to invest in pillows and t-shirts and all these different things you want to have great vinyl to put on it yeah so you need it your projects and your projects will become to you <laughs> exactly so guys this is the collection we are so excited to get crafty with you but I need to showcase some of the amazing I haven't even shown Rachel this um I've been showcasing some of the things from the membership group just because you all are awesome like the projects the members I mean you all are just blowing me away every single day and we have quite a few people that are not part of the membership group but have a membership so join the Facebook group come hang out with us um I just want to showcase we people have, are already going crazy over the collection look at their little pets Aww. we have um Kathy yeah Kathy. we have Kathy sharing her fur babies <gasps> look at Kathy's Aww, fur babies pictures. right oh and then look we have some others that I think left comments. Let's see here. What, why am I not? Oh no. Oh, here we go. And then we have Peggy. Oh, oh, look, okay, this cute. is Peggy. And then look, we've got Heidi. Heidi's right here sharing oh, her dogs. I uh, love it. It's like the Christmas card. I love the staging. I love yeah. the pets. They're freaking adorable, yeah. um, which is awesome. Heidi just commented too that she has a Shih Tzu. So that was oh, Heidi's dog. And right then there. look at Sherry's, our fur baby. Oh, <gasps> oh look at it. Look Pretty at little. her. So cute. Guys, we have some of the best. So We've got some of the best. And let's see if there's any. Oh, we have Tammy. She's a new member. Made this with a great file from the Christmas collection. Pardon my door. We're in the middle of a big addition to our home. Guys, I couldn't even see, look at it behind the door because the project blows me away. That is so she made that yes she That's made it so cute. she's so awesome and so, all our members are so crafty so if you're not already a member join the membership come hang out with us it is so much fun i promise you if you love our videos if you love our free videos you're gonna love our membership and the cut files and you get crafty like we are giving you a new inspiration every single month so are there any questions uh, yes diana wants to know hey, how diana. thick is the board you use for the nail art and i'm not um, sure it is use. yeah it's I would say an inch. Yeah, I would say an inch. You want something thick. You want the thicker wood panels. Yeah, you want to make sure your nails will go through without, you know, being too flimsy. Definitely. And then look, oh my gosh, so my friend Simone actually used one of our files as a stencil. And then use these awesome that markers. That is the cutest. Right? Isn't Simone so crafty? I'll, Simone is so crafty. I love and Simone, Simone. Is, a, is a hard working mom. She, she is. She doesn't have time to craft, but yeah, she is awesome. So definitely come check out the membership if you haven't already. I'm trying to see. Oh, we have another uh, member making some projects. Rachel, I want you to pronounce her name. Um, how would you pronounce that? She's adorable. She is so cute. I don't. Oh. I just see. I just wouldn't want to. I know. Mess I don't want to mess it up. So maybe she can let us know how to pronounce her name. Yep. We love her projects. She's awesome. Mejia. Look at all of these. Yeah. Mejia? I don't know. Maya. 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 Mia. Maya. I, I don't know. Um, but yeah, we have so many. You're, You're adorable. adorable. We love you. Um, and there's so many awesome things. So anyway, guys, thanks so much for hanging out with us. We will come back and see you guys tomorrow with more Christmas. Nice to take a little break, but I hope you guys have a fantastic day and let us know if you have any questions. Thanks for watching. Bye.